Uh, this was a fantastic event happened uh, over the weekend in Anaheim VidCon. It's called. It's a place where Internet fame comes to life and where a smartphone can launch a career. VidCon, a place where creators, their fans, brands and merch collide. Hollywood is no longer just Hollywood. It's really like these kids care about um, people who are making content, people who are on YouTube, who are on Instagram, who are on TikTok. The event started in 2010 by YouTube creators Hank and John Green. The first year had 1,200 attendees. Last year, it was 55,000. Hank and John just noticed that YouTube fandom and community was really becoming a thing. Since then, social media has exploded with creators, the new celebrities. What do the fans say to you when they meet you? Hey, are you Mikey? Oh my God, it's so nice meeting you. That's practically all. Can I get a picture? And can you sign this? <laughs> Anaheim, the biggest show, but it's expanded to include Baltimore and Mexico. Tickets run from $100 to over $1,000 with different tracks for fans, creators, and the industry. What do you like about it? Uh, I get to meet different creators and it also all, I, I get to waste my money on stuff. And I also get to dress up. One of the excuses is to cosplay. And I really enjoy doing that. Think dressing up as your favorite character for Halloween, but any day of the year. I get to like take pictures with other people. I get to compliment their cosplays, and it's honestly really fun. The show floor mostly filled with kids to teens, many with parents in tow. This mom chaperoning five kids. It's good, you know. It's it's clean, wholesome fun, and they just have a blast. It's it's kind of crazy and nonstop, like for three days. Uh, I think it's worth it. VidCon, a place where one can dream. The moment we walked in, I'm not going to lie, it was really just an overwhelming sense of inspiration. And where dreams come true. If you have a point of view, if you know how to create content that's engaging, you could become the next celebrity. That's what happened to Jordan Matter. He went from photographer to YouTuber, now with 23 million subscribers. It's a great career, but you got to do something that is uh, truthful to yourself. Uh, so, And don't copy people, do something original and be consistent. Be consistent. That's the number one thing. Don't give up. Just keep posting every week. Pick a time, pick a day, and do it every week, and eventually you'll find an audience. The barrier to entry, as simple as a smartphone. VidCon, proving that in the digital age, anyone can become the next big thing, and really all it takes is a smartphone, consistency, like he mentioned, and that unique point of view. And it's true, 100% true. Richontech.tv is the place to go if you want to learn more about VidCon. By the way, this has become such a big business. You know who owns VidCon at this point? Who? No. Paramount. Really? Oh. So they bought it from the original yeah. creators. Wow. They bought it from the creators. So wow. it's just wild how, just what a show that is. Like, yeah. I had fun. Like, I didn't want to leave. Right. Did you pick up any tips? Seriously? Like that, everything he said, Jordan, like just, just standing in the room with these people that have made it big, that are just average folks, it's very inspiring. Fun to see it. Thank you, Rich. And you were saying you could still start today. Yeah, absolutely. There's Pick up your no, phone, nothing start holding recording. You back. I mean, the, the world, it's not a you know, zero sum game. Yeah. That's the best part. Nice. Right on.